What's good y'all, it's Yalik. So we are back with another video. In today's video, we are going to be talking about the truth on Hellverse, man. The truth is, bro, a lot of you guys have been expecting this update to come out for a long time. So have I. We first received our first sneak on Hellverse and they were talking about it all the way back in April. And it is now August and a lot of people would have thought it would be out by now. If you told me or any other types of player back then that Hellverse was still not going to be out, we would say you're bugging out your mind, bro. Because... They literally showed us the map, they showed us so many things and we thought it was so close. But I'm here to tell y'all right now, we still got at least like two to three weeks, if not a month plus, bro. Do not expect it to come out this month because they said in the announcements themselves as well that they would be telling us that the update's coming out in two weeks. And we haven't gotten anything near or somewhat of that announcement or any update on the progress or anything like that we even got the strongest battlegrounds owner clowning on the game bro because they know hell versus nowhere near coming out from the leaked things if you guys didn't know pretty much a lot of files got sold of course that's not the most updated file but i'm letting y'all know right now it's got to be pretty damn close if it was in Cetro's hand and he was the one working on the game as well alongside all the other developers and I'm not making any claims saying, oh, the update's coming out on this day or that day or anything. But what I can tell y'all is we're not getting the update this month. So actually yesterday, Nuova himself said that a lot of the developers after this update, which was yesterday, they're going to start working more on Hell 100%, which can show you that it's really not that close to coming out. Sure, we have seen the true Bonkai's. We have not seen too much Sclavides, but we've been seeing a good lot. I'm not going to lie. They probably are like a good amount of progress on. I don't want to say any numbers because that would be spreading misinformation, but think about it next week we we were supposed to get visionary rework yesterday we were supposed to get the wrong car universal we we're supposed to get the murasama rework we didn't get any of that so that means on friday we're gonna get that update they said they're not releasing the update until spirit uh segunda comes out and every segunda is out dev segunda to be out so <clears throat> if next week they're working on visionary and they're working on the wrong car universal murasama and things of that nature that is one week down the road so that is what i'm gonna have to go ahead now that updates are only on saturday since they don't want to keep compete with deep Woken anymore that's on the 17th so we get visionary we get murasama and all that stuff on the 17th which is a pretty solid update right but then what are, what are they going to work on next? Maybe one of the Segundas. The chances of them dropping two Segundas at once is very unlikely. And they haven't even sneaked anything. And they always sneak the stuff before we see it. Most of the time, unlike only Butterfly was like the random occurrence of something dropping without any explanation. But let's say they work on Dev Segunda or Spirit Segunda. That'll drop on the 24th for the next week. So we're already about to hit September at this point. And then they're going to drop the last segunda whichever either one bro and that'll be on the 31st so we're already jumping into september and then not only that they have to give us that notice just like they said in the announcements they said themselves they will give us a two weeks notice that hell versus on the way without giving us an exact update like an update day or anything like that so let's say we get that announcement on the 31st then we're not getting it until september 14th let's say we don't even get it till the 7th we're not getting it till september 21st and if you're asking me bro at this point we're looking at a conquest situation bro like this shit is getting deep into the point it's gonna be it's gonna be like waiting for deep woke and conquest i'm not gonna lie bro i don't think they're gonna take a year or anything like that but i will say i would not expect it at all this month if you're expecting it this month you might be tweaking out your mind unless they do make an announcement say um, they're gonna say screw all the other segundas and work it on everything else and just jump straight into helpers bro on top of that being said bro i don't see the point personally bro devs you guys are cooking with a lot of the new things but i think it's ready for all of us to just head straight into Hellverse and stop dropping anything else. It's just too late at this point. At least that's my personal take on it. I don't think the game's gonna die or anything like that to any devs watching. I don't think, oh, it's gonna die. It, you guys have that outlook because of Hellverse. Hellverse is clutching right now. I'm not gonna lie. The hype built behind it like, oh, Hellverse is gonna come next week. It's gonna come next week. And people 
being delusional thinking that for the past three months is definitely going to keep the game on an uprise for now i just think why drop the blast blue thing why drop uh, light saguna was early just why drop these random what the hell is butterfly bro that is not based off of any bolt standing at all so i just don't see the point in working on things that don't have to do with hellburst or not fixing the things that already need fixing bro we didn't get acid saguna for the longest we still don't have dev saguna we still don't have spirit saguna which i don't care bro drop hellburst without that shit because i don't think anybody gives a fuck about any of those but i'm just saying though that personally not even personally bro i'm damn near speaking for the entire community i know a lot of you guys in the comments are gonna feel me on everything i'm talking about in this video bro just focus straight on Hellverse, bro. We cannot get an update for the next two weeks. Let the game die out a little bit and build up the hype. Hey, guys, on what, bro? September 1st, you're going to be getting Hellverse. Everybody's going to be hyped, marking that on their calendar, skipping school, whatever the hell it is, even though it's on a Saturday. And going, or no, that's not even on a Saturday. And going crazy, bro. I think that's the smartest way they could do it obviously the devs are gonna do what the devs want to do but at this rate if they just keep adding new mode if we get a nether new mode think about it there is nothing for us to get anymore i don't even think there's a possible i could go look at sneaks right now i don't think there's anything possible for them to randomly drop an update on so they just need to stick to this visionary re rework go straight into helpers bro give us that two weeks heads up or whatever it is obviously it might not be this week it might not be next week like i was saying but stop adding new shit if you guys add another new mode bro at this point like we're just on a conquest bro there's there's no point in adding anything else new to the game bro we're gonna get true vanka we're gonna get true segunda segunda whatever you want to call it the rework a lot of people have been in my comments i don't care bro we're, we're getting all those modes. Nobody cares about all these new things, bro. Butterfly is shit. A lot of people don't even like Snake because you got to do like some key binds and download shit. People are in my comments saying, how do I download key binds? How do I download macros? I'm like, bro, I don't know, bro. I might not even touch that shit because it's that complicated. If it is that complicated. I don't know. I haven't even rolled it yet. But that's just my take on everything that's going on right now. Of course, you guys can agree, disagree, bro. I just think it's time for the devs to fully lock in. Nuova did give us some type of hope saying they're going to start working on it. But I'm really hoping that all of us going in and working on it is T minus one week, bro. T minus two weeks and we're getting it by the end of this month. But unfortunately, it's not looking that way. Like I said, if you told us players, if you said you leak so in back in what, April may and you're like yo bro hell is still not gonna be out two three months from now i would be like you're crazy bro they're actually so close to being finished we've been seeing sneaks on shibuya kt we've been seeing hell vs map sneaks we saw all the damn true bankai's pretty much there's no way that shit won't be out in three months but hey here we are bro no shade to any of the devs personally i think we're gonna we're gonna go even crazier later down the road but it's not going to be as much players it might be more fun there might be more pve based content going on in the game there might be a lot more to do in the game a lot more missions a lot more whatever you want to call it quest bro there's going to be a lot going on in the game but it's just not going to be for all the players this time it's going to be for like maybe 80k 90k instead of like 100 y'all know when i was predicting 200k 150k and stuff at that point it might be possible but at this rate, school started and stuff. They didn't organize the time right. It is what it be, bro. I honestly think they've been working faster since Central's been gone, though. I'm not going to lie on that part. Y'all been going crazy with that. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Leave a like on this video if you agree, if you enjoyed. And smash that subscribe button, bro. We're on the road to 25k. Thank y'all for all the support y'all have been showing me, man. I'm hosting a fat-ass giveaway in my Discord. If you want to go enter, bro. Get some universal, any damn weapon, Hakata, uh, Stream of Ray, any of that stuff, True Blood Essence. Go ahead and join that. I'm going to catch y'all boys in the next one, man. As always, it's your boy Yulikso. Peace.